Hello and welcome to your Vedic Lunar Scope for today, the 27th of August, 2015. The moon today, as it has entered Aquarius, is in the early portion of the sign of Aquarius as it's making its way through the nakshatra of Shravana. And today you're likely to be able to see something with crystal clear detail. You can see how all the various threads of a situation are interwoven and creating something which is very firm and very strong in your life. But just because it's very firm and it's very strong in terms of its presence and the reality with which it's associated, it doesn't necessarily mean that you like it. You may even be desirous to make a change today, and that at least is a good thing. But if your heart is not behind the path that you're required to take in order to reach your destination, it's not really going to matter. Right now, you have a really strong opportunity to make a very positive change in your life and to set the wheels moving in a very good direction, which uh, stands to bring you the potential for lasting success. But it's going to require that right now, in the moment, that you eat a small piece of humble pie. It's not the direction that your ego wants. It's the direction that your soul wants. And so your ego is going to have to surrender to this situation. So, are you ready? Good. Uh, Shravana is an artha-driven nakshatra. It has as its aim achieving a specific goal. And it's symbolized by the ear. And it's associated with the ability to listen. And not only to listen, but to bring together all the different things that one is sensing. And the type of hearing that is associated with Shravana is not just hearing with our ears. It's full sensory awareness, being able to pick up on things with your senses to the extent that what you're picking up on is absolutely crystal clear. It's associated with Vishnu. Now, Vishnu took many different forms, but underneath all those forms, it was still Vishnu. And all of those forms may have ultimately looked different. As a matter of fact, they did look different, but underneath them all, it was Vishnu. And there's some symbolic meaning in that particular concept which is all these different threads are coming together and you're able to see the underlying reality behind that particular situation. And again, you may not like what you're witnessing, but the direction which it is providing you is actually a very good direction for you to take. The Lunar Kitty today is Shukla Treyadashi. It's the 13th day of the bright half of the moon. And this particular lunar titi is likely to fill you with a sense of strength and also a sense of desire with which to make a particular change. You definitely want a change to happen, but you're kind of holding yourself back because you're not happy about the direction that you necessarily have to take. And that's where the solar lunar yoga comes in today, which is Shobhana. Shobhana means splendid, but today's solar lunar yoga is not very well supported. And due to that, well, it's, it's got you kind of wavering, even though you do desire for a change to take place. So if this fits the bill for you, and you do have a very difficult situation that's approaching for you, and you're needing a little bit of guidance in terms of, well, how to make your heart match up with your mind and really set things rolling in the right direction, or even if you just want me to take a look at anything in particular for you, I should mention that I do offer several different levels of astrological service, which are available through the astrological services link, which you should see in the left-hand corner of this video. Additionally, I am offering a, an advanced or rather intermediate level predictive course. I'm saying advanced because it's more advanced techniques than just regular um, predictive techniques, but it's an intermediate level course in terms of um, what knowledge you need to have of Vedic astrology in order to take the class. Um, and it's a predictive level course um, offered in three different modules. And if you're interested in this particular course, which can teach you how to narrow a prediction window down to uh, within a few days and predict events down to within a couple of days, then you can follow the link that's in the bottom right-hand corner of this video, and that'll take you to the course registration page. That's going to do it for your Vedic Lunar Scope 
lookout for today, the 27th of August, 2015. Until next time, please take the very best care of yourself. Bye now.